The following is an audio recording of the Mangala Sutta, translated as Blessings by Narada Tara. The narrator is Jennifer Hawkins of the Secular Buddhist Association. Thus have I heard. On one occasion, the Exalted One was dwelling at Anatha Pindika's monastery in Jetta's Grove, near Savati. Now, when the night was far spent, a certain deity whose surpassing splendor illuminated the entire Jetta Grove came to the presence of the Exalted One, and, drawing near, respectfully saluted him and stood at one side. Standing thus, he addressed the Exalted One in verse. Many deities and men yearning after good have pondered on blessings. Pray, tell me the greatest blessing. The Buddha Not to associate with the foolish, but to associate with the wise, and to honor those who are worthy of honor. This is the greatest blessing. To reside in a suitable locality, to have done meritorious actions in the past, to set oneself on the right course. This is the greatest blessing. To have much learning, to be skillful in handicraft, well-trained in discipline, and to be of good speech, this is the greatest blessing. To support mother and father, to cherish wife and children, and to be engaged in peaceful occupation, this is the greatest blessing. To be generous in giving, to be righteous in conduct, to help one's relatives, and to be blameless in action, this is the greatest blessing. To loathe more evil and abstain from it, to refrain from intoxicants, and to be steadfast in virtue, this is the greatest blessing. To be respectful, humble, contented, and grateful, and to listen to the Dhamma on due occasions, this is the greatest blessing. To be patient and obedient, to associate with monks and to have religious discussions on due occasions, this is the greatest blessing. Self-restraint, a holy and chaste life, the perception of the noble truths and the realization of Nibbana, this is the greatest blessing. A mind unruffled by the vagaries of fortune, from sorrow freed, from defilements cleansed, from fear liberated, this is the greatest blessing. Those who thus abide ever remain invincible, in happiness established, these are the greatest blessings. This has been an audio recording of the Mangala Sutta, translated as Blessings by Narada Tara. The narrator was Jennifer Hawkins of the Secular Buddhist Association, secularbuddhism.org.